basically the biggest source of microplastic is uh, the plastic waste going to the oceans. So there are huge, you probably have seen the pictures, uh, so there are huge, uh, I would call them islands of, uh, of uh, plastic floating in, in our oceans. And it's uh, over the time it, it, it granulates. They are, the plastic bags are becoming, and all the plastic items on the oceans, they are becoming little granules, which the fish are eating. And if, if nothing is changed in 2050, in our oceans there are more plastic than fish. So this, uh, this plastic is coming to our bodies too, because we are eating fish. So this is one of the things which raised interest of commission. And we can do things, but it's not fast, neither easy. We have to influence those countries which are leaking plastic to oceans. They are mostly in Asian countries or in Africa, mostly in Asia. So we have policies uh, towards them. But we can do also a little bit here in Europe. For instance, for preventing plastic leakage uh, to our nature, to our seas, to our lakes. But also, uh, one concrete issue of the Commission is planning to do is to, is to regulate um, makeups so that we ban plastic, uh, plastic chips using or plastic training using in makeups. There are those who use scrub creams, scrubbing creams, know that there are scrubs or cranes, they are sometimes plastics. And then we are washing our faces directly to the water which goes to drains and it usually ends up to, to water circulation. But even bigger issue than makeups are clothing. In many of our clothes there are plastic fibers. And once we are washing our clothes over and over again, this plastic is going to our water circulation and it may be enough to our bodies. So you are right when you said that we should replace plastic where it's possible. Australia is a forest industry country. My country is also a forest industry country. And I know that there are already now new technologies which can uh, produce clothes of pulp. Pulp is not only as a raw material for paper, but you can, you can produce clothes, replace plastic fibers by pulp. So, uh, the more or the quicker we manage to apply these technologies, uh, the amount of plastic in our society will 